We talked a little bit earlier about, you know, is the defense kind of at a fracture point uh, in that defensive meeting room. Kevin Stefanski addressed the defense and, uh, and that very topic. I think when you're three and seven, there's frustration. I mean, that, that's what we are today, three and seven. Um, but bottom line is we got to be every person in this building, players, coaches, staff, you name it, have to have that attitude of, of fixing anything that needs to be fixed. And that's where our focus is today. Um, I can't speak to those specific things that those guys said, but those are conversations I'll have with our guys. And that was kind of in reference to the questions you had about Joe Woods or being prepared or, or those uh, kind of things. It is not good with what's going on with the defense. Yeah, the, the, the big problem with the defense is they were supposed to be really good, right? Like that's the problem of is that if they were supposed to be okay and they were this bad, I don't think they would be as angry about it internally um, in the locker room. But the fact that they're supposed to be really good and instead of being really good, they're really, really bad. That's the problem, right? Um, that's the issue that they ultimately have defensively is that they stink on levels that they should not stink at because they're too talented to be this stinky. And I think they bring that up um, all the time whenever they're interviewed. And I think, look, you're going to have uh, locker room problems whenever you stink like that and you're that disappointed. You're going to have issues it's not going to be a fun place to work when you're three and seven and it's solely because the defense is completely underwhelmed it's not gonna be a fun place to go defensively same way the offense wasn't a fun place to go and look we can talk about hey is this going to destroy the locker room for years to come the reality is is it does not matter like it did not matter with the offense could baker mayfield destroyed the locker room offensively last year you can make the argument but did it matter this year no because you got rid of a bunch of people that's probably what's going to happen on the defense side of the ball